it's kind of one of the things where, you know, it's uh, real touchy right now. So um, we're trying to rev it up a little bit more. And, you know, even though one day I tried to work out hard and um, they didn't work. So, you know, we had to restart the process a little bit. So um, I'm just you know, taking it day by day and, uh, you know, get, I'm going to get a good workout in uh, before the game and, and keep working on it and keep trying to uh, progress. Yeah. How concerning is it just, I mean, we're seven games from the playoffs and, you know, I, I think back yeah. to a year ago, you were really going at this time last year. It's, it's different. For me, I got to find a, a way to get a rhythm, but at the same time, uh, I don't want this to come back right. in the playoffs or right before the playoffs because then I'll be out <clears throat> longer and I'll really lose rhythm. But um, I think it's, uh, I'm, I'm taking my time in this process and making sure I'm completely, fully healthy because the last time I tried to come back from this, right. I, I didn't even finish the, first, the second, you know, second quarter. Assuming your body permits it, is, is it important for you to, to be back with two, three, whatever amount of games left it is before the playoffs to get? Uh, yeah, for sure. I, I, I plan to be back before the end of the season is over. Um, you know, that's the plan. So hopefully we go according to the plan and um, uh, things work out. But, you know, of, of course it's important to get out on, there with, on the floor back with the guys just to get a little bit of a, a rhythm and a feel. Does it feel worse than it did uh, before tweaking well, in Detroit? Uh, uh, it's feeling better. You know, I think it's, uh, you know, the, the process is getting better. The back is it's still very tender and, and sensitive, but the process is, is definitely getting better. Kyle, are you at the point where uh, you, there's like three, two, three games left, and it's it's better, but it's not perfect, and you say, man, I need some games. I, I, I'm going to get back in there. Well, I'm not going to rush it. Okay. I'm not doing it. And, you know, I rushed it in the first time, and right. you see what happened. I'm out another five, six games. So right. I'm going to take my time, and honestly, I, I don't want this to come back, and I don't want it to be a reoccurring thing. Is it a pain thing or is it a range of motion no, thing? It's a, it's a pain, it's a range of motion type of thing also. So, um, you know, I worked out last game and it, it was feeling a little bit good and, you know, I got a little bit of uh, contact. So I just want to keep, you know, keep making sure I can keep getting contact and keep moving the same way before um, I get back out there. How frustrating, how frustrating is it at this time of year when it's the crunch time of the season? I haven't been, you know, hurt in, you know, a while. And um, it sucks when you, you can't, you're missing games because of an injury. You know, I'm a guy who wants to play, and especially this time of the year. So um, I just, I'm, I'm staying mentally fresh just so I, I can try to feel, stay in a little bit of rhythm mentally. You would helped carry the team when DeMar was out early in the season. Right? Proud of the way he's sort of doing the same now? Oh uh, Yeah, he stepped it up. He stepped it up big time. But that's what a, and a guy who is, is a perennial all-star, he could be a perennial all-star the next, you know, whatever, how many years he plays. So that's what a guy like that does. And, you know, we have a great group of guys and, and G and Lou, they're, they're holding it down and um, JJ's playing well. And so, you know, we had a group of guys who were able to um, step up when the situation calls for it. Kyle, Defensively, it, the last few weeks, it seems like you guys have figured some things out. Coach is talking about that recently. Just as a student of the game, being able to sort of be a part of it and look at it, what do you see that has changed specifically? I think uh, just our communication is getting a little bit better. I think uh, we're paying a little bit uh, more attention to the details and not letting little things slip and, and get, by, get past us. Do you think you guys can be the you are top 10 defensive team by efficiency last year? Do you think you can be that? And do you think you need to be that, given how much better you are offensively? Yeah, I think we can be that. And I think we need to be that if we want to go far in the playoffs. And how, uh, what kind of treatment are you getting at this stage? Uh, it? it's, it's a lot of you know, massaging, stretching, um, stimulation, um, all type of things that is going on. But um, at the end of the day, you need rest when it comes to the back. You know, when it comes to the back, and you know, everyone knows it, it, it pretty much shuts down when it's not ready to go. So um, the rest is the part that I need. Is it the, is it the doctors who kind of have to give you the green light, or is it well, you kind it's, of it's, saying it's, I need? To I, feel I think it's it's a little bit of both. And uh, you know, with me and the training staff, we we've been working well together so far through this process. So uh, we're just um, getting it right. Oh, what, do, what do you think you're going to learn from this experience? Not to get hurt. Well, <laughs> but did, did you come back too soon, you think? Yeah, for sure. I think I did. I definitely came back too soon, and that's why uh, I'm taking my time, and um, I'm not going to come back on that floor until I'm uh, completely healthy. You've never had anything like this before, as far as your back goes. Uh, before I had, but not the way it happened. I got a, I got a back contusion, so yeah, yeah. then the spasms came, you know, I think because of the contusion. So, um it's a, it's a tough one, but you know I'll be okay.
And there's not saying anything structural. It's no structural pain. damage. You know, it was a deep bone bruise on the MRI, and um, so you know, it was something in there. And uh, I just got to get it right and, and make sure it's healed and ready to go. Did you ever figure out exactly what play it happened on, or is it kind of exactly the type of thing play. that builds up? Or? No, I know it happened on one play. I caught a knee in the back, and it was a really hard knee. <laughs> Who, 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 who? Uh, uh, you go look at the film and tell me. <laughs>